Hey, what's up, guys? This is Puppet Mess Prime, and today I'm going to be reacting on My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Season 2, Episode 25, A Canterlot Wedding, Part 1. 1. Let's begin. 3, 2, 1. What a beautiful day. Oh, hey, they're having a picnic. Oh, hey, Spike. It is gorgeous out. Just gorgeous. And cake. <laughs> Sandwiches. Let me just get my breath. Right out of the way. Dear Twilight, I am sure you are as excited as I am about the upcoming wedding in Canterlot. Wedding? I will be presiding over the ceremony, but would very much like you and your friends to help with the preparations for this wonderful occasion. Fluttershy, I would like you and your songbird choir to provide the music. Oh my goodness, what an honor. Pinkie Pie, I can think of no one more qualified than you to host the reception. <laughs> Applejack, right. you will be in charge of the catering for the reception. Well, color me, please dance punch. Rainbow Dash, I would very much appreciate it if you could perform a sonic rain boom as the bride and groom complete their I do's. Yes! Rarity, you will be responsible for designing the dresses for the bride and her bridesmaids. Princess Celestia wants to see that. <laughs> wedding dress? For a cantaloupe wedding? Whoa. She's fading. And as for you, Twilight, you will be playing the most important role of all. What? Making sure that everything goes as planned. See you all very soon. Yours, Princess Celestia. But I don't understand. Who's getting married? Oh, wait. Uh, I was probably supposed to give you this one first. What? Princess Celestia cordially invites you to the wedding of Princess Miyamura Cadenza and my brother. Brother? Hey, brother? Twilight has a brother? Married? Congratulations, Twilight. That's great news. Yeah, great news. That I just got from a wedding invitation. Not from my brother, but from a piece of paper. Thanks a lot, Shining Armor. I mean, really, he couldn't tell me personally? Hey, Twilight, just thought you should know I'm making a really big decision that changes everything. Oh, never mind, you'll hear about it when you get the invitation. <laughs> That's funny, we should use a sandwich. Who in the hook is that? Uh oh, she's angry. Are you okay? Sorry, it's just that Shining Armor and I have always been so close. He's my BBBFF. BBFF? Big brother, best friend forever? Oh. oh. Before I came here and learned the importance of friendship, Shining Armor was the only pony I ever really accepted as a friend. Oh, I gotta skip if this is a song. I had to skip, you know, no time for songs. one of your PFFs. PFFs? Pony friends forever. Oh. I want to tell you that I think your brother sounds like a real good guy. He is pretty special. I mean, they don't just let any pony be captain of the Royal Guard. So let me get this straight. We are helping out with the wedding of not only a princess, but a captain of the Royal Guard? Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. Of course, she'll faint. <laughs> Next stop, Canterlot. I know what bachelor party is, it's where you celebrate, you know, after a special occasion. Just like your birthday, except no presents. Ever since I moved to Pony, or do you get presents? Less and, less. and now that he's starting a new family with this Princess Mia Morik, what's her name? We'll probably never see each other. Come on now, you're his sister. He'll always have time for you. Yeah. Couldn't seem to make time to tell me he was getting married. What the? A bubble? What's with this bubble for? Whoa! What's with all the guards? I'm sure they're just taking the necessary precautions. Royal 
real wedding do bring out the stranger pony. Because it's tight. So let's get going. We've got work to do. And you've got a big brother to go congratulate. Yeah, congratulate. And then give him a piece of my mind. Oh. When she said piece of my mind, is he, she gonna punch him in the face? If she has a fist? Or kick him with his, with her hooves? Is that him? I've got something to say to you, mister. Twily! Wait, oh, Twily? you, kid. How was the train ride? I... That's your brother? How dare you not tell me in person that you were getting married? I'm your sister for pony's sake. It's not my fault. Princess Celestia has requested a major increase in security. Didn't you see all the guards at the train station? Yeah, there's a big wedding coming up. Maybe you heard about it? It has nothing to do with the wedding. A threat has been made against Canterlot. A threat? We don't know who's responsible for it, but Princess Celestia asked that I help provide additional protection. This, you need to see. <laughs> The burden of keeping Canterlot safe and secure rests squarely on my shoulders. Staying focused on the task at hand is That's my it. top priority. Okay, okay, I get it. You've got a really important job protecting all of Canterlot with a force field only you can conjure up. But still, how could you not tell me about something as big as your wedding? Am I not that important to you anymore? Hey, you're my little sister. Of course you're important to me. But I'd understand if you didn't want to be my best mare now. You want me to be your best mare? Well, yeah. No I'm way. I'm honored. But I'm still pretty ticked you're marrying some pony I don't even know. When did you even meet this Princess Miyamore Cadenza? Twily, Princess Miyamore Cadenza is Cadence. Your old foal sitter. Wait. Cadence? As in the Cadence? As in the greatest foal sitter in all the history of foal sitters? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you tell me. She was your foal sitter. You mean your oh babysitter? My gosh, oh my gosh. Cadence is only the most amazing pony ever. She's beautiful. She's caring. Aww. She's kind. I am so lucky to have you as my foal sitter. I'm the one who's lucky, Twilight. <laughs> You're a princess. I'm just a regular old unicorn. You are anything but a regular old unicorn. Sunshine, sunshine, lady by the way. Clap your hooves and do a little shake. <laughs> a secret handshake. I would definitely do a fist bump, hand pie, head bump, and of course, kick in the foot. Foot kicks. And. A love I mean, potion? Twins can just spread love wherever they go. I only know of one. And you're marrying her. You're marrying Cadence. You're marrying Cadence. I hope I'm not interrupting Cadence? anything important. Oh my goodness. Cadence. Sunshine, sunshine, ladybugs awake. Clap your hooves and do a little shake. What are you doing? Cadence, it's me, Twilight. Aha. Uh -huh. That's weird. She didn't notice her. I've got to get back to my station, but Cadence will be checking in with all of you to see how things are going. I think I speak for both of us when I say we couldn't be more excited to have you here. Right, dear? Absolutely. Okay, now that well, looks suspicious. The way she's looking at it. her. Something's fishy with her. Oh, the bakery. Of course. Hey. Check. check. Double check. Best arm bite size apple pretty ever tasted? Triple check. Hmm. Check. I do. Do you? I do. Mwah. Hey, don't mess with those. Those are for the cake. Hiya, princess. Please oh. call me Princess Miyamore Cadenza. Hiya, Princess Miyamore Cadenza. You Miyamore come to check out Cadenza. what's on the menu for your big day? I have. Something's odd with her. It... Uh, delicious, 
I love, love, love them. <laughs> oh, shucks. Why don't you take a few to go? I know how you brides can be. So busy you forget to get a little something in your belly. <gasps> She's still away her apple you see what she things. Her apple muffins. That's not very nice. Oh, you should have seen how she acted back there. I don't know when she changed, but she changed. Please, call me Princess Miyamura Cadenza. Did I hear someone say my name? Oh, let what's me, up? Let me just start by saying what an honor it is to play a role in such a momentous occasion. <laughs> uh huh. Is my dress ready? Oh, uh, uh, yes, of course. Um, I've been working on it ever since I was given the assignment, and I think you'll be pleased with the results. I was hoping for something with more beating and a longer train. Oh, yes, of course. And those should be a different color. I think they're lovely. Me too. I love them. Oh. Make them a different color. Yeah, she's so Maybe her name should be Princess Demandy Pants. Demandy Pants? She doesn't even wear pants. Pin the tail on the pony. The chicken dance. Perfect. If we were celebrating a six-year-old's birthday party. Thank you. Oh, that's not even a good smile, isn't it? Oh, Luna. Rest, my sister. As always, I will guard the night. Hey, Luna. We haven't seen you since. Nightmare night. Bet I can guess what you're all thinking. Cadence is the absolute worst bride to be ever. Wait, what? Who? Me? Back. That goes on the cake. Yeah. <laughs> Do that. Twilight, whatever are you talking about? Cadence is an absolute gem. Rarity, she was so demanding. But of course she was. Why shouldn't she expect the very best on her wedding day? Applejack, did you know that after she told you how much she just loved, loved, loved your hors d'oeuvres, she threw them in the trash? Oh, she was probably just trying to spare my feelings. No, she was just being fake and totally insincere. You mean that she could be she an imposter? She did the voice of one of my birds during rehearsal. See? Rude. But he was singing really off key. Okay. Pinkie Pie, you had to have noticed how Caden's tree is. <laughs> Give me those! <laughs> Give me those! Rainbow Dash, you're with me, right? Sorry, Twy. Been too busy prepping for my sonic rain boom to pay much attention to the bride's bad attitude. <gasps> the princess is about to get married. I'm sure any negative behavior she might be displaying is simply the result of nerves. Uh oh. And I'm sure it's the result of her being an awful pony who doesn't deserve to even know Shining Armor, let alone marry him. Mm. Maybe you're being just a tiny bit possessive of your brother. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am not being possessive. And I am not taking it out on Cadence. You're all just too caught up in your wedding planning to notice that maybe there shouldn't even be a wedding. Oh, that's bad. Twily! Your big brother's looking pretty good. Don't you think? Huh. Everything okay? We need to talk. I think you're making a big... <clears throat> Uh-oh. No, uh, it's her. Hi, sweetie. She sure has a way of sneaking up on people. Could I speak to you for a moment, dear? Better see what she wants. I'm here to talk to you. I thought I made it perfectly clear I didn't want you to wear that. This was my favorite uncle's. And? And I think I should wear it. Are you disagreeing with me? I guess I am. <sighs> oh, wrong dear. With Are you getting another one of your headaches? <gasps> oh, my goodness. Feeling better? <sighs> mm -hmm. She isn't just unpleasant and rude. She's downright evil. That explains the greenness. Twilight. Let her go. Huh. It seemed like she had something else she wanted to tell me. 
Well, she noticed something. Sorry guys, I had to deal with my mom. She's bringing me extra blankets. Because, you know, it's getting cold. Winter or fall is coming. Well, today's the day. girls. No need to rush. Or it's a practice run. Then, of course, Cadence will enter. They're gonna practice. I'll say a few words, and then we'll begin with the vows. Shining armor, you'll get the ring from your best mare. Do you? I do! Hey, has anybody seen Twilight? Do that! I'm here! I'm not gonna stand next to her! And neither should you! I'm sorry, I... I don't know why she's acting like this. Maybe we should just ignore her. Wait, you what? have to listen to me! Oh, goodness. Are you okay? I'm fine. You sure about that? Shut I've up. got something to say. She's evil. Evil. Oh, evil. 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 She's been horrible to my friends. She's obviously done something to her bridesmaids. And if that wasn't enough, I saw her put a spell on my brother that made his eyes go all... So cough it up. Uh, why are you doing this to me? Because you're evil. And I have proof. And if I don't stop you, you're gonna ruin my brother's life. Out. You want to know why my eyes went all <sighs> Because ever since I started having to perform my protection spell, I've been getting terrible migraines. Cadence hasn't been casting spells on me. She's been using her magic to heal me. And she decided to replace her bridesmaids because she found out the only reason they wanted to be in the wedding was so they could meet Canterlot royalty. And if she hasn't been on her best behavior with your friends, it's because with me being so busy, she's had to make all the decisions about the wedding. I was just trying to... She's completely stressed out because it's really important to her that our big day be perfect. Something that obviously wasn't important to you. <sighs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go and comfort my bride. And you can forget about being my best mare. In fact, if I were you... I wouldn't show up to the wedding at all. Oh, this is terrible. Come on, y'all. Let's go take on the princess. Oh, great. Now her friends, too. And Spike. I have a lot to think about. Maybe I was being overprotective. I could have gained a sister. But instead... I just lost a brother. What the? Cadence? I'm sorry. What the? You will be. I knew it. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. Kanan's is actually evil. Twilight was telling the truth. Oh gosh. I wonder who she really is. Maybe a, a, dis, a person in disguise that explains the eyes. Yeah, that rhymes. Oh great, now I'm rhyming. So, stay tuned for the Kenderlot Wedding Part 2. Just remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell, and smash it. I'll see you guys in Part 2.